Praise be to Jesus. Last Saturday, I um, I explained that on the weekend when there isn't much Catholic news, that I was going to make a a post about um, some other things that I thought were important, and I was focusing in on. Um, uh, um, directives that uh, Jesus gave us to do um, in the Gospels and last week was on uh, make disciples of all nations I offered a way um, to help your brothers and sisters uh, a very relatively easy way uh, that could really um, bring a lot of souls to Christ uh, this week um, I want to focus in on something else. So that would be um, that Christ told us to pray for our enemies. So, you know, I, I would hope that all of you that hear this uh, spend a few minutes a day anyway um, praying for uh, the enemies of Catholicism or your personal enemy or um, so um, what I'd like to do is to uh, offer you two prayers. The first prayer is a very old prayer from the, um, I believe it's the um, first printed Catholic prayer book. It's called the Recolta. And uh, this particular prayer has a hundred days indulgence. And that's followed by a, a very short prayer um, from St. Maximilian Colby. So there's, you know, maybe a minute and a half worth of prayer here. But if it's something that you do every day, it uh, adds up and you'll be doing what Christ told us to do. Um, and if you, you know, for maybe I hope the very few of you who just it never occurred to you or you just don't pray for your enemies or the enemies of Catholicism. Um, I hope this will be sort of an impetus for uh, you to do that. So this weekend I offer this to you and uh, enjoy your day and uh, we'll talk to you next time.